Pošli me nadal bar od marca. Ja, Ja, Marč! Ja, znaj. Rien haun da gut afternoon. Trails and ales from Wales. Off a stike path. Been a disastrous day so far. I decided to lose my coat on the train and I had to just grab anything in the bull ring in Birmingham and now I've got a coat for the next 10 days that's not breathable and it's heavy and we cannot get a taxi from Chepstow to Sedbury Cliffs so I walk in it there and back just before dark not good We're just peeling off this two miles this evening, so we don't have to do it tomorrow. And in front of me over there is the latest version of the two crossings of the seven bridges. Shambolic beyond belief this. We've just walked through them fields there looking for the plaque and we cannot find it. Try not Mart! Now this seems absolutely crazy. We simply cannot find the plaque. And it's getting dark. Now, we came behind these trees here. Up here. And at last we found it. How shabby can one get? Hidden away. So a bit cloud off that off as dike path. Now this is for now and this is for a few months time when I reach Chepstow on the Wales Coastal Path because I won't be coming here from Chepstow because I've done it today. Shop shavings there. Right. Ah. <laughs> Fuck. Do do well? Absolutely nothing in front of it. How shambolic. Sticks required in these parts. <coughs> I nearly went on my backside on the way here. More than once. Now here I went wrong earlier on. I went down there. I should have gone up these steps and it's only on the top of that hill there. The first or last 50 sign. Happy birthday.
Chepstow Castle. Borida, good morning. First day out of ten of the Offer Stike path. Chepstow to Monmouth today. Early start in the rain. It's cooled off a little bit now, thankfully. I've left my mate behind. He'll soon catch up. He's quicker than me. And a little bit of blue sky now. Stayed in the town house, bed and breakfast last night. All good. Bed and breakfast every night for the next nine days now. And the old seven bridge in front of me. Some sort of old quarry underneath me here, I'm guessing. There's some lovely capped gardens here. Looking down at Tinter Nappy. You may pause the video should you want to read the sign. Ooh. Turning out to be a nice day now. I'm still skirting the upper reaches of Tinter. Now there's a choice of routes here. To my right is the higher route via the Hutnals or down to my left, Brockweir and River Wye, which is the way I'm going to go. Plus there's a coffee shop in about half a mile or so. I'm in Tintern Old Station now, about a quarter of a mile off route. The fit way in. <sighs> Leaving Tinter now along this riverside path. Ten miles to go. Now here's a nice looking bridge. Oh, 
I've seen these trucks back before. Hi. How are you? Have Hi. I have I seen you somewhere before? No. <laughs> Gloucestershire Forest of Dean. Back into England. Monmouth down in the valley. About four miles to go. Martin has got half his wardrobe on his back. Absolutely brutal climb out of Redbrook now. Got to be one of the steepest climbs we're going to do for the whole 10 days, I'm guessing. And I'm out to go more, come on, Kai. Yep. Hello. Oink, oink. Ah, uh, have a good drop. <laughs> I read somewhere, don't remember where, that this section of the walk the first day was one of the prettiest walks going i would have to disagree with that hardly any views all day absolutely brutal this is called Come in, whatever that means. Monmouth. Oh. Oh, huh? That's what you call a nine coink. Gigi here. Gigi. <sighs> Cheerio. Last mile or so. At long last. Powell, Powell, Powell. Absolutely shattered. Very cosy and quirky. Pint. Eighteen and a half.